Hey everybody, we're the Nerds and we're here today at McKay's. So McKay's is like a huge store for nerds like us that do like book reading. Uh, Steph is a huge book nerd. She loves to they read. They have music, they have games. Yep, everything. They do have some new stuff occasionally. Mostly yeah. everything is going to be used, but some really good prices. They have McKay's in Knoxville, Chattanooga, and Nashville, Tennessee, and also Winston-Salem and Greensboro, North Carolina. Mm -hmm. So again, it's just a really cool, like, used mostly bookstore we love coming to. Steph is, like I said, a it. huge book nerd. I cannot so. wait. I'm going to go get yeah. me a stack. I'll show you guys what I get. When yep. I come the out. prices here are amazing. We love coming mm -hmm. to McKay's. It's just outside of Nashville. So if you're in the Nashville area, make a stop over here. And with that being said, we're going to go inside and become book nerds. Let's go. Let's go. Right as you come inside the caves, you got selling over here to the right. So you can sell used items, and then you have all the things to purchase over here to the left. And there's the checkout counters right there. So this is the book area. We're on the mystery thriller area now, and we'll show you more of the stores. Toys up front, Funko Pops, all kinds of cool stuff. What are you finding, stuff? I don't know. I'm just looking right now. Like um, this section, mystery thriller. A lot of well, this is one of my favorite sections. Fantasy, young adult romance. I read it all. And if you notice too, they have it uh, all it done by author too. Yeah. What are you saying, stuff? Uh, I was about to say the same thing. I'm not big in Mary Higgins Clark though, I, but they have a ton of her books. So I was going to show like the prices. This book is 50 cents. You know, um, this one's 5.75. So some are a little more, some are a little less. 50 cents on that one. What is this one? $6.25. There's just such good prices. You can get a stack of books. Yeah, and we've bought plenty of stacks of books here. Probably hundreds of books from here over time. And you can just see there's just rows and rows and rows. And turn the corner and there's more rows of books that everybody can see. There's the upstairs area. And then head back to where Stephanie was. There's just more and more. There's stuff there. And again, it's just everywhere you look, there's books. There's Sandra Brown. Uh, Stephanie's read Sandra Brown a lot in the past. I got the Christie. I mean, this is just one aisle, but you can just see how cool this place is. The Silent Patient. For so long. Eleven fifty. This is eleven fifty, but it's not in the best condition. So I was hoping they had another one. Yeah, and what Steph's talking about the condition was. Let's see if we can find some duplicates real quick. Uh, some of these books here. Here's one right here. It's like there's three of them here, and so sometimes. These, I don't know if these are different prices or not. Three fifty, four twenty-five. Yeah, and but you can so, tell the spine on this one. This is hard to hold. It's more worn. The four twenty-five one looks, looks worse though. It does. But it's yeah, really weird. How and this one's torn here. That one's also four twenty-five. But see, this four twenty-five when the pages aren't as in good condition, there's some bent. So. So yeah, so sometimes we'll have just one version of each book. But see, there's three right there. So you, if you come here, definitely take a look and see which one the condition is the best in for you. Or maybe if you don't mind something like a little tear like that, maybe it says you a dollar or so if you don't mind a tear. Another author that Stephanie likes a lot is J.D. Robb. Wasn't J.D. Robb doing a ghost writing as another author too? Nor Roberts. Nor Roberts and J.D. Robb. It's the same person. Same person. So she writes these under J.D. Robb and these are all futuristic, like detective. You have all these. I have every single one of these. The last five or so are on my Kindle, but I have all the other ones. And then Nora Roberts, yeah, but yeah. again, it's just so much. And then over here is board games. There's just tons and tons of board games. Some of them are new, so like this one's still sealed new. You know, this one has been opened before. But just so many board games here. There's tons of selection. I'm looking at more of the board games, as you can see, there's just board games everywhere. They have all the actual board board type games here. They also have the card games over here as well. So you can get different kind of card games. This is actually a fun game right here. Um, apples to Apples, we play that several times. That's a fun game, but they have all the card style games. They have all the board, there's Jumanji. That's an awesome movie. And there's the Game of Thrones. That's cool. Oh, they got the Halo Risk version. Huge Halo fan. Halo 2 is where I got my start in gaming. Some Halo 1, but mostly Halo 2. There's Thanos right there, even though he's upside down. Wow, I got Top Gun here. Wow, that's cool. 
at the Rick and Morty risk. That's really cool. Yeah, just so many cool things. I got the Pokemon. You gotta catch them all. It's upside down, but let's see. Got the blast toys on there. That's really cool. There's the alien board game. That's just so many good board games here. Show you some more of the titles and the board games. We got Back to the Future. It's Back to the Future, Dice Through Time. Christopher Lloyd was just in uh, The Mandalorian, too. So that was cool to see that. And the Monopoly game. We're in the computer section now. And if you are like me, I love computers. Been in IT for many, many years. It's the industry I work in. But they got Security Plus if you're going for that. There's A Plus, maybe a little bit outdated. Some good certification books there, C++, but they have Windows 8.1. When's the last time y'all seen Windows 8 or 8.1? There's some 8 books right there. This is interesting. Oh, Security Plus, MCSA. That's some good security certifications they get there. Office 2019, OS Exclusivity. You got a mix of different things, different systems here. Now into the chemistry section, so not a whole lot of computer stuff, but I still like to look at those computer books here. A Dreamweaver, haven't messed with that in years. Wow, there's a book for Java, very interesting. Oh, Photoshop right there, SharePoint 2013, a lot of good technologies here. And here's an aisle guide here for the books, so you can just see all the different aisles here, all the different categories they have. So just a ton of selection here. They have a huge section for kids here. Let's show you a quick glimpse of this. Don't go down the aisles, all the kids uh, on them, but just to show you tons and tons of kids' books, some toys up top and everything. And look, Clifford. Oh, Clifford there. It's pretty cool. So, yeah, if you have kids here, this will be a perfect place for you to come look at books. It goes down as far as the eye can see down there. Find the Star Wars section here. Look at this. The Clone Wars. Amazing series. Love the animation. The Clone Wars. Yeah, Rey's survival guide there. Uh, Rey is such a great character. Look at this. The Dark Legends right here. I bet you that's going to be a really cool book right there. Explore the dark side of the galaxy if you dare. Only six fifty for that book. You have Boba Fett. Oh, wow. Look at there. Darth Maul on the book there. Episode 1, Journal 1. I'm a Jar Jar Binks fan as well. So a lot of cool Star, uh, Star Wars books in here. Look at that. Tales from Fandor, so some of the plants. So, wow. Really cool. Hey man, to get this right here, the Dark Legends book. It's really interesting. They have a wall of Funko Pops here. I have to dig through some of these, but... Wow, they got a lot more up front too. They got some of the bigger ones up top. How's uh, the Cobra Fang from G.I. Joe up there? This is really cool. Just tons and tons of Funko Pops. All different genres and everything. Uh, there's a Terror Claw Skeletor. That's cool. Target exclusive. I got the Apollo Creed right there. Comes in a pop protector case as well for $11.95. How's oh, the Jerry in the Puff shirt? What a great episode that was. Love Seinfeld. You got the Stan Lee right there. I got Dumb and Dumber. Let's turn around, but let's see what this one is. Ski Lloyd Christmas right there. You got the Hospice Morty. You got Elmore Jetson. The Jetsons. Just so many cool things. Uh, Funko Pop wise here. Some Star Wars Funko Pops over here. This is the Walmart exclusive gold Darth Vader. I think it's awesome. You got Bo Katan. That's really cool there. You got the Knight of Ren right there. They have a lot of cool uh, the Funko Pops here from Star Wars. Hey, the Stretch Armstrong. I used to have that as a kid. That toy is awesome. Look at that Batman right there. Exclusive oh, cool. Batman. Oh, Corella DeVille. Stephanie oh, loves. Like yeah, that's really cool. Oh, I got Annabelle. Uh, uh, we are huge horror movie fans. It's a Hot Topic exclusive. And these all prices all range, so it just depends on what you're looking at. This is the Gold Series Walmart for Luke Skywalker, too. So you can get this along with the Darth Vader right there if you like the Gold Series. 
right? Oh, that's the Ray one. And then next there's the three. I think that was the Target one, wasn't it? There was the Ray there. Was he the Target one? Yeah, yeah he's the Target one. That's crazy that I know that. <laughs> I have too many Funko Pops as it is. Bless you, babe. Thank you. Look at all these Star Wars ones and just different ones mixed in here. Uh, you got Dr. Willy from Mega Man. That's so neat. I haven't seen him in a long time. No, I didn't. Grogu. Oh, he's got the Bantha. No, it's not the Bantha. That's just his uh, macarons or macarons he's eating. I thought that was the Bantha milk, yeah. But just the cookies only. There's the child with the cup. Is that what you have? No, I have the cookies. Here's the child with the cup. Oh, he's got the little tea there. That one's seven ninety five. dollars I was just on thirty one ninety five. It must be a little more rare. I wish they had him drinking the Bantha milk. The Bantha milk is just the best milk money can buy. Oh, there's Saw Gerrera. That was a really cool character in the movie. I could stay here all day and just talk about Star Wars with y'all. But this is so neat. There's the Pork up there, BB-8. I'm a huge Mech Droid fan. Oh, look at this one. Oh, look at that R2 concept series R2-T2. Never seen that before. That's really interesting. We can upstairs real quick just to show you what they have here. So where most of the music is and things like that. So country, you got records over here. Look at this. That's McKay's down there. All on the other sides, more music and comics. Look at all the electronics down there. Just look at the records right here. That's cool, but look at that. So much goodness down there. All right, I spot something right here. Bone Thugs and Harmony. So growing up. I used to listen to Bone Thugs and Harmony all the time. As if I could teach the world, this is the two so song here for the instrumental and the regular. So it's just the same song, but two versions of it. But Bone Thugs and Harmony, they also had Mo Thugs. I see one of your you other know, favorite artists. Crazy Bone. Don't just, show them. Don't show them. Oh, right there. Oh, right there. Pretty Spears. Jerry I couldn't Lynch. see her in concert in Vegas. Stuff would love me, but that's we another story. Time. That's another story. If you look at their video games here. They got Wii, GameCube, PS3, Xbox 360, Xbox One, PS4. So a good selection of video games in here. We have tons of movies here. They have Blu-rays and DVDs. Uh, so here's some DVDs to this section here. Over here to the right is some of the Blu-rays. So just tons of movies here. Uh, just some selections there. And then turning back around to this side, this is more of the older video games. So Switch, 3DS, Xbox is over here. Halo CE, amazing. Halo 2, where I got my start in gaming at. Uh, well. I played, I think maybe 20,000 hours or something like that on Halo 2 at one point. Old school PlayStation here. Retro cartridges are over here. There's N64. I don't even see Goldeneye off the top of my head, but Goldeneye was some awesome times back in the day. And then very scratched. You get some really good discount games that are scratched up pretty well. But a lot of great games. There's Gears of War right there. That's an amazing game. All the Far Cries. Just tons of different video games here. It is time for the haul. So here's the McKay's haul. Let's start off with Stephanie's books first. Okay, so I didn't find too much today. This, I have never read Lisa Jewell, but these books sounded good. I like to put them and the reviews are really good. So $7.50, these are higher than normal and $8. I got Water for Elephants. It's a really old novel. Um, there is a movie with this one, but I've never read it. So I wanted to read that. And then I've never read Taryn Fisher. It's the new author I wanted to try. So I picked up that one. And this one, I got on accident. If my mother-in-law is watching, we love these um, prey books by John Sanford. But I picked this one up because I wasn't sure if she had it. And I was going to call her and ask her. And I forgot and paid for it. So now I have my own copy. <laughs> and then for me, the Funko Pops. So I'll start with Lando here. Love Lando in the series. Uh, this one was about $7 for Lando. It looks like a perfect condition Lando. Yeah, $6.95 for Lando perfect condition and there's some more of the series right there a little hard to see with the glare uh the kari here star wars visions glow in the dark uh this one was 19 dollars. there's the more of the series they have there well, i love these colors it's a little bit hard to see with the glare right there but man these colors just are amazing that dark uh deep purple right there uh yeah 19 1895 for this one but glows in the dark and a cool star wars vision series i don't have yet and then we were checking out and this was an unexpected purchase right here Let's see if we can hold it differently so there's not a glare there we go i think that's good that right better? there yeah i'll turn a little bit as we look at it but the thor love of uh, thor love and thunder box set uh 45.95 you can still buy this at walmart right now but it's like 48 dollars. so it's a better deal here 
you can see a little better right there but they got the thor the my thor uh the valkyrie and the gore there so just a whole setup here mint condition too of it some of that love thor and uh love and thunder from thor and so that was really cool so that was a good buy there for 45.95 there's the back of it there you can see them really good there here's the other ones in the series right there um yeah we love that movie that was a really was good a Thor really movie, good movie yeah. and again this was behind the counter so some of the more expensive and or better sets are behind the counter so if you go here and you see some Funko Pops you like get them of course because they they do go fast sometimes but they also check behind the counter they have a couple other sets behind the counter that are usually more expensive or more rare sometimes and this one you can still buy at Walmart but it's about three dollars cheaper so we got it now so there's my set Akari my Lando and my Thor, I probably have maybe at least 100 Funko Pops, maybe 150 at the house. Yeah, so I don't more. need any more, but I'm still buying them. Love them. That was McKay's. So we love coming to McKay's. Awesome. You saw the haul we got there. Some Funko Pops, a Funko Pop set, some books. Uh, they have, you know, movies, CDs, uh, toys, video games. TVs. The little small TVs up there. You know, stuff. we couldn't even, we filmed everything here. We have a four hour video. <laughs> uh, but yeah, just definitely check out McKay's. Again, multiple locations. Nashville, one here close to downtown. Knoxville, Chattanooga, in Tennessee. And then in uh, North Winston, Carolina. Winston, Salem, and Greensboro. I keep wanting to say Winston Churchill. Winston Churchill is at McKay's. Actually, he's no, not. No, he's not. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah, Greensboro, Winston, Salem. So, yeah, just check out McKay's. It's a cool little shop. Mm -hmm. We enjoy coming here quite what? often. There's a bug joining us now. He wants to go shopping with us. And, yeah, that was Ian. So, I guess the nerds are out. But hopefully you enjoy this. You know, you see a little more of our nerdy side. Uh, Stephanie's a huge book nerd. I'm a huge, I got statues, Funko Pops. Uh, you know, I'm big into Code of I'm huge I'm big into Sideshow. Yeah. Uh, I got a life size Grogu at the house. Uh, I want the life size Yoda, but that's like $6,000 or $5,000. Give me what it is. It's so not happening. I don't know where that's going to go at. Um, anyways, <laughs> I got too much stuff at the house now, but um, it is some more Code of Bakia's. If you ever look up uh, Code of Bakia, it's an amazing statue company. Uh, they make a lot of Star Wars stuff, you Star Wars fans. So. Yeah. With that being said, I don't I'm gonna talk for four hours about statues and Funko Pops, but check out McKay's. You won't regret it. It's a pretty cool place. Some good deals to be had, uh, especially if you don't mind getting things used. You can get some really good deals here. So, mm -hmm. that being said, the nerds are out.